One nursing home experiencing great heartache is St. Therese in New Hope. That's where 55 residents have died and another 147 have tested positive with COVID-19. Dozens of nurses, housekeeping, and food service staff also tested positive. So as Bill Hudson shows us, a restaurant and business brought in boxes of kindness. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Words of gratitude at this senior residence and nursing home. Honor the heroes behind masks and gowns. The staff braving the state's deadliest coronavirus outbreak. They're heavily affected right now, and um, I, I can't imagine how hard their staff is working to kind of keep up with this. With thousands of dollars raised in donations to support its own affected employees, digital marketing firm Horizontal decided to share the love. We've got a Reuben that is all Thank homemade. So We've got Thank fresh tater tots. From the back hatch came the boxes holding 80 lunches for St. Therese staff. A simple gesture to treat those on the front lines of the pandemic. We're here to support the staff and, and tell them thank you for everything they're doing and, and the risks that they're taking every day to come in here. Partnering with Redstone American Grill, who made the meals, bore a secondary benefit. We're struggling. We need the support we can get as an industry. They raise the money, do the donations, give to the nurses, and everyone's winning, and it's, it feels really great. And for a nursing home staff that suffered the loss of so many, it's but a simple box lunch, but a meaningful way of giving thanks for those braving the front lines of battle. We are very gracious for all of the donations and support that we have received from our community partners and families during this tough time. Bill Hudson, WCCO 4 News. Horizontal workers say they will select another deserving facility for lunch delivery next Friday.